being punished for something? Really? Do we have to? <sighs> Human Centipede Part 2. Hey, I hope you're not time wasting you. I've got a dozen people waiting to look at this place. Hey, come on, let's get this lease signed, eh? Because your mother is very worried about you. He keeps on talking about a centipede with 12 people. What does that mean? The centipede can be considered a phallic symbol. Yeah, apparently the first one was very successful. Everybody apparently loved it. I mean, apparently it was approved for kids to love it too, I guess. I don't know. So, yeah. Back in 2011, someone came up and said, you know what, that first one was so awesome, we should make another one. Except for, let's do it in the most weirdest way you can imagine, and then some, and we're gonna make it three times more gross. Yeah. Basically, a guy got expired by the movie Human Centipede and decided to try to make his own Human Centipede, uh, but longer and not as good. Yeah. I, I, I mean, it, it was just, ugh. <laughs> I thought the first one was kind of bad. I mean, it was at least horrible. You can under, you can deal with it. But the second one, oh my god, that, that was just gross. And then some. I mean, you literally had a scene where a guy who wanted to make his own human centipede is trying to make them all go and take a shit, and they're not, so he injects laxatives into them, and you're literally getting shit spraying between the cheeks on the walls. Ugh. That was just, just gross. I mean, that was just bad. And they tried definitely going for the shock value, you know, with a, a pregnant lady, the crazy ass mother. I mean, ugh. and the ending, no. I mean, it was just bad. I don't know what the hell is wrong with people. That just. Ugh. No. And they're talking about part three?